And we're here with another episode of our Empire of Trebizond campaign for 1212 AD Medieval Kingdoms Total War. And in the last episode, we had a glorious battle against the Latin Empire where we were challenged by a lot of Latin knights, um, but we prevailed. Uh, the Blades of Mercy just about survived. Um, very battered, as you can see. Um, but we we were victorious, and now we can siege uh, Sisychus. I have no idea if that's how you pronounce it, but with very uh, with a very good chance of success. So we'll uh, attack that in the next turn, and then we will march on Constantinople. Uh, I mean, both these that army looks pretty bad. I don't think you could deal with that garrison either. So we're looking okay there. Um, looks like Venice is probably going to take Rhodes for itself, and then. Um, after that, we can move on to Philippolis, I guess. So that is our final target when we take out these two settlements. And then we'll make a bit of a... Well, hold, we'll, we'll stop for a bit and see whether um, people want to see the continuation of this campaign. Obviously, also, we will replenish our empire. It's kind of a bit worn out from all these wars that we've been fighting. But um, I think I'll end the turn. I don't think there's anything I want to buy, uh, build or buy, especially. Um, let's have a look. I don't think so. No no mercenaries we can get. No, we're not in friendly territory, so we can't. Um, we'll end the turn. Oh, no, we can assign a provincial governor. Dora Leon. Okay. Have I got anyone of age? Isaacius? You're of age. Why can I not make you... Rude. Um, I guess we'll put... Strategist. Metal. None of these are very good. I guess you, because you're a defender, so you'll be handy when defending territory. Oh, I could have made it Nicaea or Snoke, actually. Can I change that? I don't want it to be Doralean, really. Can I make it Snoop? Thomas. Kick. Oh, I can't. Oh, that's annoying. I'm sorry, Thomas. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Um, well, we'll put someone else in then, I guess. I'll just put Strategist in and make it Snoop. There we go. I spent some money. I didn't really want to, but hey, we did. And then put growth in. Perfect. Um, there's going to be a rebellion here. Not this turn, but the turn after that. So we'll send this army to go and put it down. The wrath of heaven. And then, uh, well, we'll just see what happens. I mean, I don't even know. They may attack in the turn that um, it happens. So if they do, then well, we'll just see them off. That's all you can do, really. But anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed the recent content. Thank you so much for the support. We're nearly already at 950 subs. It's amazing. We're going to be. We're already nearly halfway there to a thousand. Um, well, we're over there, a halfway point to a thousand because that's 500. But you know what I mean. From 900 to a thousand, we're almost halfway there. It's amazing. I can't. I can't thank you enough. And it seems like the Empire of, uh, not the Empire of Nicaea, the Latin Empire is fleeing. It's going to abandon its city. Um, its agent looked like it did so, and hopefully it hasn't attacked Leon or the king. Or the Basilius, as I should say. He is our emperor. Um, and killed him. Hopefully not. I don't want that. But anyway, yeah, Thank. just going back to what I was saying. Thank you for the support. Um, all the likes, the subscribes, all the comments. I love all your support. It's so much, so massively appreciated. And the Blades of Flippin' Mercy. I'm going to put Andronicus back in. Did he assassinate? Did he kill? Came Dane murdering one of her own. Right, so looks like. Oh, David's died of a natural cause. That's not great. And Ankyra is going to rebel. Okay, well, we'll put you into. Ankyra. Mm, well, I guess the garrison in Kyra is probably okay. I'll put you into Snoopy. Snoopy. That's definitely not how you say it, but hey. That's how it's being said now. Um, what do you hate? What did it just. Difference is this sorting itself out, you fool. Iranian pretenders and military investment. So Leon got wounded. Good God, this man. Right. Um, we can attack like this. Or what if I attack like that and attack this guy? Yeah, I thought that'd be the case. He runs off. So I guess it's less troops for us to uh, worry about. 
Yeah, that's okay. That's a better aura result. Uh, just aggressive. Stab him through the face. Yes, and he's dead. One less Latin settlement to worry about. Occupy, thank you very much. Um, we'll put you into Nicaea, so you're helping there. I don't think that army's going to be really under threat. We'll rebuild that. We'll rebuild this. Rebuild that. Rebuild this. And we'll put in a... What have we got? We've got... That's going to be minus two squalor. That's actually helping with public order, so that's good. That's helping with public order. I don't actually want a Jewish dis... Uh, dysporia, whatever it is. I know it helps with wealth, but I don't really want extra Jewish influence right now. It's not what we're here for. Uh, I could put in a blacksmith... Town barracks, possibly. Town barracks then means I can get uh, cal Trasbite cavalry. If that's it, then it's just helping with the garrison, which does help in public order, in fairness. Um, but I think our public orders might be okay here. Muster grounds, obviously that does stuff there. I don't necessarily need another one of them. Um, I'm going to put in a Platea for now. And replace the Jewish deposit here. We'll see what how that helps. We'll see what d that does. And we do have mercenaries we could hire, but not that these ones have any space for them. Um, and we don't have any money anyway, so it doesn't really matter if we had any. You're just starv uh, starving, and well, not starving, but being killed by disease. So we won't worry about you. Oh, I can arrange marriage. Who can be married off? I bet it's Isaacius or whatever his name is. Um, and Isaacius is going to try and get married off to someone in Sicily. Greetings to you. Offer, oh no, I can offer a daughter, Ulia. And, and her. Uh, I could just give you him. You, you take that quite high. Well, I'll, I will take the 51-year-old. She's of nothing, no worth to me now. Um, no, I thought that would be a bit too much. Uh, arrange a marriage, have her... And a little less than 2,300. That's high. A little bit more. 2,800. Moderate. Yes, that's perfect. Now we're going to be able to fund some more stuff. Jerusalem. Arrange marriage for Raymond. Oh, yeah, you can have her for the, your king. 3,000. High. Perfect. Right, there we go. Money spent. Well, not earned. Not spent. We're about to spend it on some good stuff. Dorlean, no, maybe Smyrna. Um, yes, Nolid Press would be nice actually. That gives us more money, more squalor. It's always a problem, but we can deal with the squalor. Um, we do have a fountain here actually. We just need to put in a Craftsman's Guild, which we are doing next. So that's perfect. Um, end the turn. Oh no, we can still assign a governor. You. You to. Trebizond, please. Trebizond. Uh, Trebizond needs that. And then we also have... I feel like there's something else. Romanos. Yes. Don't think any of these will help you. Uh, oh, yeah, you can have that. Illuminated Bible. It's going to help with pub, uh, Orthodox Christianity in your region. That's good. Um, you don't really need any of them. I'll put taxes in and I'll put in... Um, that one to help with public order. Authority will help with public order. That'll be good. Um, and there we go. End the turn. Perfect. Making 3,463 a turn. That's very nice. The Ottomans there rebelling. Um, definitely can't take any of my cities. So I'm not too fussed about that. We've stopped the rebellion going on at Sinope. Um, and Kyra has got its rebellion. We'll put it down next turn. Um, and then we're just going to have to keep an army garrison here. Probably two armies because Matalea is also... Well, actually, no, we can... Oh, Malatia, sorry. Not Matalea. I said this... Oh, have they got pretenders? they got Latin Empire pretenders. And they're fleeing north. What is this bizarre move that they're doing? I'm just going to just take Constantinople in the next turn. That is going to be excellent. We're going to take... No, I'm not joining that war with the Ubids. No, we've had too much excitement with the Ubids already on the channel. If you haven't checked out my Jerusalem campaign, I fully recommend you do. Um, it's a great, great campaign where we try and reform the Empire of the Altarima. Or just the Holy Land. Take it back from the Ubids. A lot of fun. A lot of... Uh, quite a bit of frustration, I personally thought. I thought there was some frustrating niggles, but we got through it, I think. 
Iranian pretenders. Valerios has died. Oh no. And more people are dying to starvation over here. But it's not over. And it's not over. <laughs> oh dear. Um, foreign trespasser. Raiding. Well, that's fine. I'm just going to put you down right away. Wrath of Heaven. Uh, and they're going into the Turk lands. Oh, this, but I'm going to. I am going to get rid of them. They are very frustrating. Uh, there you go. Aggressive. Kill these guys. Ottomans are dead once again. As they always should be. We'll integrate those men. We're saving Europe uh, from a scourge that will take on Santinople itself. Um, yeah, we'll do that and we'll do that one. Zeal. So we get uh, zeal and some integrity. We'll put that into Snope. Uh, Snopey. It's going to probably be just... Yeah, this army is probably just going to be putting down rebellions for like the next however many years because these regions won't be happy though I could make this one happy I think if I could put a meat market in that will make that happy uh, yeah I'll do a meat market helps with growth and then I can put in like a potato or something like that to help that get happier um, I can now attack Constantinople by the sea that's what I plan to do there we go take that by the sea that's actually not going to... Uh, we'll maintain the blockade. I'll put a second army into the sea. See what that does. And then if not, I will just siege by the walls as well. Uh, can I just... Can you just... Where's the port there? That's a lot better. Right. Um, I would fight this. Like... But with those odds... I might just, I might just take it. Constantinople is ours. Um, yes. There we go. I guess <laughs> it's just so easy. I was going to fight this because I thought, well, um, we don't need to worry about. Uh, we'll have stacks to fight. But there we go. We have formed the Byzantine Empire. The restoration of the empire. The Byzantine Empire. The Empire of Trebizond is no more. As the rightful Romans now rule in Constantinople once more. The true Roman Empire has been restored through pretenders in the west. Uh, Though pretenders in the West would refuse to call it such, within the Empire's borders, hope that it may soon return to its former pre franco creation Oh god, that's a word. franco creation glory. Despite its precarious position, Byzantium is posed to become a great power once more if the Turks in the Anatolia and its rivals in the West can be defeated. There we go. So is it called the Byzantine Empire now? On the map? It's called nothing currently. Um, maybe that will change when I end the turn. I don't know. But at the moment, it's called nothing. Um, I'm going to destroy this. I'm going to rebuild, rebuild that. That's a fishing docks. Uh, yeah, we'll have a fishing docks there. Why not? Let's destroy this. Oh, this is all Latin stuff. This is not very handy. Uh, destroy that. and Destroy that so we're going to get more money from it. Because that's what I've been told. You get more money from stuff doing that. Um, we will put a... Um, yeah, we'll put a castle in here, and, oh, I didn't realise that these were not ours. I thought they were just, oh well. Um, do we have anything we can do? Can in we, the name oh, of the state, welcome. can we get any marriages? Because I'm sure Isaacius is of age. Let us talk and then enjoy good Roman military wine. access, that's high as well, so let's just get some expensive military access out of you. Yep. No, that's, that's too, that's too expensive. Uh, a thousand, possibly? Uh, military access? Yes, there we go. Very good, very good. Right, Sisychus can just, like, get that converted. No, it still can't. It's fast. Why is... It's so expensive. It's so expensive to get a goddamn in our farm good name, converted. Uh, trade. Speak in yes. Finally. Even These guys will trade with me. Words. That's high. That's moderate. That's... Oh, rejected at moderate. Wow. Not not sure why I'm surprised. Fifteen hundred. My best deal I can do for you. Thank you. Finally, right? We can. I don't know if that's actually allowing us to see anyone new. I don't think it is. Actually, sir. Oh yeah, we can see a lot of new people. We can see Bohemia and Austria. We are. Um, arrange a marriage. I can demand some wives. Um, for Isaacius, who is twenty years of age. But shut up. Um, but I'm not going to take. Welcome. That one, hopefully. Be by your I'd like to take 
a wife for Isaacius, who's a bit younger, just so he can Speak produce some children. So that I may go to the... the Polish are so rude. He's just saying, oh, yeah, you know what? Let's flip the middle hey, finger welcome. at you. Let us talk and then enjoy good Roman wine. Uh, have I'm sure you will accept this. No, you won't. 300. There we go. Non-aggression with Serbia. That's fine with me. I'm probably going to have a war with the Bulgarians, if anyone. Um, I've still got to finish off the Empire of Nicaea. I don't actually think they've been dealt with. Nope. Still being sieged out by goddamn Venice. Right. Um, could put a pigsty in. Helps with wealth, as does... Well, just about everything helps with wealth. Uh, cattle herd's the best one for wealth. And what can we put in? We can put in another fields or an artist studio, which does help. But I'd like some Sisyphus here to help with public order. Well, I know we've got one already, actually. Um, and Orthodox Christianity is going up. Why is it? Instability is the main reason why it's hated here. So it might be okay. I could possibly just put something else in that's... Uh, just different. <laughs> Trade with Croatia, yes, please. Um, Thirteen hundred. Oh, more. Eighteen hundred. More. Yes, please. Give me all your money. Right, that's good. Arrange a marriage. Uh, no, I do not want. Do not want a corrupt wife for my Isaacius. Hail. Uh, here we go. Fertile Beatrice. Yes. Perfect. Give me, give me your wife. Your, okay, yep, yeah, more. Yes, let's have all the money. Right, there we go, perfect. Right, we can, I could probably actually afford to convert some of those things in Constantinople now. I will put in, could put in a church, could put in a fountain, but that's gonna, oh, it does help with public order. Uh, yeah, we'll put in a fountain. Yeah, why not? Um, can I convert any of this now? No. Because it needs rebuilding first. So we'll just carry on knocking it down. I bet... I'm guessing all of this stuff just needs, like, convert. I might as well hold on to the money, then, and just convert it all next turn. Yeah, that would make a smart move. Um, so we'll do that. Can you move? No. Right, let's... Can you recruit mercs? You could. Don't know if I want to. I haven't actually got any cavalry. So I could put some mercenaries in there. Some Georgian Lancers. Yeah, go on then. Let's put some Georgian Lancers in there. Perfect. End the turn. Okay. No. Low integrity. Execute some deserters then. Um, we can put a provincial governor in. Thomas, you're going in to Kaffa now. There you go. You got your position. Uh, and you can have the Edict of Growth. Because we need growth to carry on for making this place nice and happy with more stuff. Yes, I've done the given the order to execute some people. He's had his orders. He knows what to do. Kill every tenth man. Let's see if uh, the Latin Empire respond in any way. They might, they may, they may not. Here they come. Well, one, one's going in the direction of home. One is going in the direction of the Black Sea, which we may intercept with an army. I do have my army around Malatya that can just... Well, it's actually not in Malatya at the moment, but... Um, it's in Sinope, or how you say that. Um, it could always go to Trebizond, because that's probably where they're aiming for, because... Well, I guess it's the only sea-bound settlement. And thank God no one did any diplomacy with me. Did not need any more. Oh my gosh, stop dying. Greek fire. What does this do? I don't know if I want to... Yeah, go on, we'll pay for the restoration. Greek fire saved. I had so much money I didn't realise. Um, your actions have guaranteed that Greek fire will continue to be manufactured. Yes, fine, that's good. Um, Andronicus, I would like to block the promotion of that guy. We're making 5,000 a turn now. That's excellent. Um, we now have uh, Craftsman's Guild. So we can build hot springs and baths and other stuff like that. It's excellent. Uh, I'm going to go down this one. I'm going to do advanced 
arch uh, castle architecture just so it gives us extra holdout time but also allows us to get some new castles and stuff like that which is always handy to have so let's see what shall we convert this to a large city probably um, we will convert you to a uh, orthodox basilica convert you to a patea convert you to a hmm I don't know well if I make or oh, Jewish community is just there okay right well I'd like to probably put in a tavern um, taverns are always handy obviously we need to convert the food place as well but if I put it if I put in a food thing what would else would I want well, not a food If I put in a tavern, what else would I want? Maybe a... Well, this is noble to mercenary. Ah, this is frustrating. This is a frustrating thing. Here we go. Right. So, which one is my... Oh, there's mines like the Prenori's... Prenori's Palace. So, I'll probably put in that one. Yeah, we'll put in that one then. Uh, I have a potato and put in a Prenori Palace or whatever it's called. Definitely butchering names, but... What can you do? Um... Well, not a lot, really. You can just have to deal with my uh, bad pronunciations. <laughs> it's all you can do, really. Um, I'm going to put this army... This, that's the fresh army, so the Pazelias can move on. I'll keep this army in Constantinople, then. And we'll carry on to Philippos, and we'll start sieging Philippos, I guess. Which is always handy. Right, so what's their garrison? I should have just looked. Oh, it's pretty awful. And they will surrender in nine turns. Well, we need that to go down. To be honest, that is far too high. Uh, what can we recruit here? Pretty much nothing. Um, I may move to Trebizond since it's garrison's not well, the, not the garrison. The uh, happiness isn't great, but we are growing. So I'm going to put a platter in, and that will probably sort it out for once and for all. Um, you're still starving, but you've started to replenish. Thank God, actually. You've stopped starving. We've got replenishment. That place is saved. Good God. They had the worst sort of, like, I don't know, disease I've ever seen. <laughs> um, uh, can I get any money out of something? Because I'd like to build a found, um, upgrade that fountain there. Um, probably could get it out of, like, Bohemia. On behalf of our people, I could arrange a marriage. I could offer a daughter, friend, another daughter. Who's this going to? The wisdom. king, forty-two. I could do. If nothing, if it comes to the worst, I will do that. But I'd rather give, rather give that uh, daughter to someone a bit more her age, just for ethical reasons. You know. I know we're in the medieval period and all, but uh, you know, I've still got a few ethics. Um, Jerusalem. You probably don't have anyone that I can marry her off to. Actually, we do. Requested, ah, there we go. Someone requests. more your age. 27. 19, 20, and 27. That's a bit more... Okay, then 42. But, yeah. Well, it's still not great, but it's better than nothing. And there we go. We've got plenty of money now to upgrade this for hot springs. Um, I could put this one up. This one's already on hot springs, but we could always put this one up. Um, that would help with public order as well, so we'll put a bath in. And then we're kind of back down to the amount of money we had before. Um, which I could put... Oh, I was going to put a meat market in here. So see if we can get a bit more money out of someone so we can get a meat market going. You are a vassal of Be welcome. Uh, Bulgaria, talk, but would you want anything like some of this? And we're still not called the Byzantine Empire. I know we're the Byzantine Empire. In my heart. But, uh... It doesn't say it, which is a bit of a shame. I kind of hope they sort that out uh, to the modders. But w we can see. We can only hope and pray. Austria, would you Your like anything? Reputation goes before you. I'd just like some cheap... Speak. <sighs> no, I want some money off you. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this, you stupid people. We're going to do it properly. Right. Non-aggression. Right, that's fine. 900. Yeah, that's fine. That's all I want. Some non-aggression so I can get a meat market in here and help Trebizond get back on its feet. Though, in fairness, the food case actually here is not great. So I probably should put in... I probably actually just leave it as it is. Oh, yeah, I should probably leave it as it is. And Actually, no, we'll put it in for now. And then when we do eventually grow, because this will help with growth, uh, then we can put a 
the tear in and then we can because that won't actually affect food to start with and then we can put in a tavern and then we can convert this because then we'll have gone into a deficit of food by 15 then we can sort it out by just changing that to a uh, I don't know a cattle place or something like that that'll do so we'll end the turn uh, oh, we have an unassigned skill for you you're a governor you probably don't have anything useful you could have a decorated sword but I don't know if I really want to give you that uh, just have that I guess and have uh, actually no I don't really want to give you any of them we don't have so many uh, authority and cunning please there we go one in each perfect end the turn see what happens Will the Latin Empire try to retake its city of Constantinople? I doubt it with that small army, but I've seen wackier things happen, so we'll see. I'm hungry, what are you doing in the Black Sea? Okay. I think this guy's going to try and kill my Pesalius. That's just hopefully not going to happen. Yep, yeah, he's just too good and he avoided that like a beast. So that is perfect. And now, yeah, they're definitely going for Trebizond. I don't even think they've got a large enough garrison, um, a large enough army to take my garrison. I might, I will move the other army there, just in case. Papal states, moderate. Well, I'd like some money out of you. Make it three hundred. Considered, it can be harmonious even between unlikely partners. There you go. Have your non-aggression then. I guess we'll have it. If that's non-aggression is you accepting me as the true Roman Empire and uh, holders of Constantinople, then yes. Oh, we're in a war against these guys who are there. Yeah, sure. They're not really a problem to me. More of a problem to you. Judy calls Blades of Mercy again. Did the guy just die of old age this time? And not a... Well, Leon's going back in. And... Okay, so the... One of the Mongols is dead. Yeah, Andronicus just died at the age of 79. Wow, Romanos. Ankyra is going to revolt. Assassinate the following guy. Amano, Amado. You're Theodosius. Amado. These are rebels. I don't really, really want to do that. Oh, and they broke their... And they broke their siege. Interesting. We may need to send this army south then. Um, Interesting. Well... We will do that. I'm going to first send this army over to Trebizond. Just stop them from doing anything stupid. Nice here. Got a population boost. So that's always good. It's on plus two currently. I'm going to put in... It's actually on zero food. Don't know if I really want to tangle, mess, mess with that. Um, I could just put in a bath to make it happier. We could just then put in a artist studio and just leave that like that. And that would actually be perfectly fine. That would then help with that. Yep, yeah, that's actually that works perfectly fine. Um, you could carry on see can carry on sieging, or I could bring this army up. Leon's army could yeah, Leon's army is pretty pretty healthy. Just make it two two armies to to take it. Let's just auto resolve that. Very nice, nice easy. I know it's an all. I don't. I know it's all resolved. I just Attila siege is a bit naff. Very broken. Um, I, I could subjugate them, but no, we'll occupy. We'll kill these guys off. Is that the Latin Empire dead? Is that them technically dead now? No, I guess not. They're just starving. Resource gain, though. We got manufactured goods. Um, let's just destroy that. Um, hmm. I think I'll destroy that. I'll destroy that definitely. Destroy that definitely, and. Hmm. I'll repair that because that's already tier one, and I can re I can always replace the artisan. Uh, you can't actually reach anywhere, but go back to Constantinople. So you're just in range, I guess. Wavering loyalty. There was someone wavering on loyalty. Um, oh, a couple. Right. Let's just put you. Um, let's sort out our loyalty then. Let's just. You can secure the lo loyalty, of Romanos and Isaacius. No, where's Leon? He could probably do some loyalty changes. Yeah, you can just secure the loyalty of him. Zacchaeus can't do anything. 
This Isaacius can become a uh, Logothes or whatever that is. Um, David died. No, my boy. Um, yeah, I think that's kind of it. That's all we really need to do in like the whole, that whole front. Um, what else? I guess we could we could raise a fourth army. I have the money. Um, Smyrna. We could raise in Smyrna. I don't know really what they have in Smyrna that's gonna be able to be useful though. Excuse me. Uh, Pronoi Lancers. I presume that you have like, oh, not that one, Rune City. Um, yeah, you can actually get most of the stuff that we need. So yeah, you can have an army. Um, Alexius maybe unit. Unit experience for melee. Yes, which one's the younger one? Alexius is younger. Right, raise a fleet. The companions. Yep, that sounds like a good enough name. And you can have some. Put in some swords, just some cheap swords. And then you you have the task, sir, of taking roads for us. That's not a bad garrison you could take. That's uh, actually that's a pretty good. That looks like a good garrison. And they're building an army. The Emperor's Vanguard. Well, you're not the Emperor. We are. Um, yeah, these archers look okay. Um, and those look like some pretty nasty skirmishes. And they've got some cataphracts. Yeah, this could be interesting. But at least it's against other Eastern factions. Not against the Western ones. Which just destroy us. Um, with their cavalry, usually. It's just a goddamn mess over there. Um, right, when we when this grows eventually, we're going to put in a... Uh, Patea to just make a tavern and make this happy. That will be fine. Um, I think that's probably where we're going to wrap up the episode. Actually, no. Let's just upgrade this guy uh, quickly. Let's put in... Can't do anything here. Could put map campaign. Uh, no, let's make it more cunning, I guess. And personal influence. Why is he so low on everything? Is he just... Jeez, this guy. Has he just got a lot of negatives? Yeah, he's got quite a lot of negatives. God. Well, we're sorting him out eventually. <laughs> um, right, well. There we go, guys. I think we've taken Constantinople. We've taken the Byzantine Empire. If you want me to see... If you want to see me uh, expand it to maybe like Thracia and the Balkans. So take out like Bulgaria. Maybe even Serbia. Maybe Croatia. Epirus. And, well, I may take out Thessalonica in a further episode anyway. Just to get rid of the Latins once for all. And I mean, Achaea is actually a Latin city itself. If you want me to take all of Greece and like the Balkans, then let me know in the comments. Uh, and leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here. And Because likes also show if you're really enjoying. And I will then continue this uh, campaign a little bit longer. We could even go after the uh, Turks and their pretenders over here and just deal with them. And sort of unite uh, most of Anatolia. Along with Rhodes. We haven't actually taken out Rhodes yet. We could take finish our other rivals off once and for all but like i said guys if you enjoyed please leave a like and subscribe and until next time legionnaires bye for now